Oh, okay. Well, I, <laughs> I'm back. I used the tower key on this door, so that opened that. I wonder where this. I wonder if it's just like an omni key. You know what I mean? That works on everything in the tower. Maybe. We don't know. Now where am I? Twilight herb. That can't be it, really. Oh, here we go. Ah, jeez, gosh, depth perception. Um, what is that down there? Is that just like rock? That's interesting. Uh, oh god. I'm afraid to see if there are any going to be those uh those lizard fire salamanders that are in the forest of the fallen giants. I sure hope there aren't any of those around here. Seriously, like, I'm not just saying that to joke around. Oh, cool. This is cool. This looks sick. Iron hallway entrance. I am. Oh, check it out. We got a summon room. Ah, haven't seen too many signs so far. Oh, that was actually. Uh, are these? These are NPCs. Steel willed Lori. Oh, that's cool. Cool. I like these NPCs they've had in the DLC. They've been cool. Especially Alfie. Trick Blue. That's awesome. Drifter Swordsman Aldi. Adi? Adili? Huh. Okay, well, this probably leads to a boss. I should probably summon some backup. You know what? I'm going to summon... What? No, Trick Blue. Was, was that a real person? Holy shit. Okay, I'm going to summon you. Usually, they, yeah, I was going to say, usually they only give us two. At max. And I'll summon you, because I have so many options now. <laughs> so where are we going, right? Uh, wait, before I pull that. Dashing through in shortcuts. Well, obviously, I should definitely pull this. What is that over there? Oh, please don't actually be like a li- I only s It is! Fuck! Close it! Close the door! No! Close it! Oh, fuck, guys. I was just joking when I said the salamanders would be there. But honestly, it makes sense because where they are in the Force of the Fallen Giants, there's a key from the Iron Keep that opens the door down there. So, I don't know. Maybe he put them there? I have no... What the fuck? How many guys are there? Jesus Christ. But no, really, like, those salamanders suck. God, please no, FromSoft. Please no. It is one over there, isn't it? Or is that just like a, a thing that's shooting stuff? Okay, we had a whole bunch of cells. Okay, it looks like one, but it's not. Is that a mage down there? What the fuck? Like we're in that we're in the wizard robes, the archaeology or our our not archaeology, space one, the stars, astrology. What the fuck is going on in this place? So many, like, cool and interesting things. Okay, there's got to be something in one of these, right? Guys? Oh, dear God. Guys. Guys. Okay, I'm obviously... Oh, my God. <sighs> FromSoft, please fix the game. Zero out of ten. Zero out of ten. All right, I'll have to check them later, because I can't have myself getting, like, trapped in each one of those cells. Oh, uh, God. So there had to have been some point to that, right? Oh, you know what it did? I jumped down and I just realized what it did. It also opened the gate at the end of the hallway. Well, that was... So basically, I went through the trouble, but didn't reap the reward. Guys? Guys. Guys. What the fuck, guys? <sighs> okay, guys. Let's try this again and not, like, huddle up on me like all the NPCs do. I swear, I don't know why they program them to work that way, you know what I mean? Like, they program them to, like, lock on you when enemies aren't around. Like, look at this. Oh, really? Oh, really? I will kill both of you. You guys think it's funny. See how they're locked on me right now? That's not... I don't know why they have them do that. It's kind of weird. Okay. This will release all the dudes out of their cells, but it also opened the thing at the end of the hall. Get him, steel wheeled dude. Yeah. 
the clusterfuck up there. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. So much carnage. That yeah, twin blade really wrecks things, huh? I haven't really used a twin blade yet much at all. Okay, let's try this again. We can't. Oh, oh, okay. Okay, so you need to you need to run immediately. You need to not even wait, you just gotta go for it. Alright, next time if I die. Which, you know, I'll try not to do, but no promises. He did he just roll into that? Bullshit. Look, like, the NPCs just aren't affected by that. Like, I get thrown back and lose, like, half my health. They don't give a fuck. Oh, you can stop those guys mid-attack. I didn't think that was actually gonna work. Kill her. Is that a... Oh, shit, the mage is healing him. See, look at that, I lost so much fucking health! And, of course, neither of these guys are ranged attackers. Dude, are you kidding me? That's not Estus. Motherfuck. Dicks. We are gonna kill them. Come on, guys. Yes, kill him. Kill him while he's here. Uh. Yeah, motherfucker. That's an interesting looking dude. Like, he's wearing the, uh... Those, uh... Oh, my God. I hate you. Jump! Oh, God. Plunging attack. Dude, are you kidding? Ah, oh, plunging attacks suck in this game. I know I kind of missed there, but still. It's like, taking a plunging attack is such a risk to begin with, like you're... Oh, fucking really. Guys! Guys, no! Guys! No! Fucking NP... That's it, we're not summoning NPCs again. God damn it. They, they get me killed more often than not. It's really fucked up, because they, like I said, they lock on to you. I don't know why FromSoft think that's a good idea, but it's not. Woo! Oh yeah, okay, well that worked out pretty well, actually. Sup, motherfucker? What is he even wearing for? He's like got an aura around him. Really? That didn't... Oh, it slowed me down. Oh. So if I get anywhere near him, I immediately get slowed down. Wow, that's fucked up. Yeah, just give that to, like, online players who use sorcery. Like, that'd be fucked up. That'd be, like... It's like doing everything to screw melee users. For real. I know, like, melee users are, like, the common thing. Um, it's always, like, the fallback if you... Oh, my God. If you run out of other shit. But, uh... God damn, man. Like, I'm serious. Like, if I was playing through a sorcerer right now on this playthrough, I'd be doing way better. Like, way better. Just because I wouldn't have to get near any of these enemies that have all these, uh, like, area of effect things around them. That's really classy from some. Like, they know those are probably... I would say those are the toughest enemies in the whole game. Very difficult to kill. With anything. Even with magic. Just because they have the range attack that is absolutely rape. Like, it, it just is. <laughs> Where am I? Am I... Where am I? Oh, no. Okay, I heard something. I was like, what is that? Yeah, no, none of that. Okay, I don't know, I always get ner Oh no. Another one? Okay, let's see over here first. Probably an option to go around that. It's probably the same concept where I'm going to have to run for it. Oh god, like there's like way more dudes. Shit. Woo! -hoo -hoo. Okay. Cool. Interesting. <laughs> I did it. Yes. And I was a little bit trickier. This place seems huge. Like, this whole DLC seems very big. Even bigger than the last one. Dicks! Oh god, did it... Did he, like, resurrect that thing? Oh, so they're dead to begin with, and if these guys are around, they can resurrect them. Yeah, there was still that one guy back near the very beginning, like the second bonfire hit, where there was a door that I couldn't get through. 
Uh, where are we? Okay, it's only... Wait, no, there's another way. Uh, do I want to go that way, though? It's... This is... This is very... It seems very, uh... Not maze. Like, a lot of, like, uh... Tunnels, though. Isn't there a term for that? Like, a maze, but it's underground? A labyrinth? <laughs> David Bowie? <laughs> I don't know. Um... I'm probably going to jump down here after I kill one of these guys. Because that bow dude is like really tough. There's an item here. Not a good item. Oh, this would, would this have just dropped me down here if I was careful? Okay, so I could still get on that way if I wanted to. Ah! Well, fuck. Shit! I don't want to jump down there because there's like a bunch of backup for him. Alright. It's very strong. Thank god I killed those guys in two hits. Okay. There we go. Uh... Maybe backtrack? This is probably the way it would have thrown me down if I had jumped down from somewhere else. Seems like it's made up of multiple different paths of shortcuts and like semi shortcuts and then different like levels. There's like a bad way to go and kind of like a quick but like safer way to go? I don't know. Like a less direct and then a more direct? I haven't figured it out yet. Here. Are you sure? Do you know what you're talking about? Random person. Tough enemy ahead. Sniper. Good. Good. Shit. Shit! He's already made me slow. Damn, he's aggressive, too. Alright, well, come at me, bro. Not like that. Like that. I love the rolling attack on this sword. It's the whole moveset works out very well for me in situations like that. Oh, fuck. Ah, fuck. And that's gotta be the boss over there, too. Alright, let's, uh... See if I can't snipe this guy. Dick! God! I can't even tell when he's really firing. Oh, but fucking... Ugh. Just go for it. What have I got to lose other than my life? See, there would have been some way to like get up... Dick! There would have been some way to get up top here. Which would make this easier. Go for the door! Oh god! What?! Smelter! Oh shit, he looks fucking badass! Yeah! This is one of my favorite fights! Toughest fight in the main game, in my opinion. Da, 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 da. One of the best tracks, too. The Rune Sentinels and this guy. Oh, yeah. Dude, he looks so fucking cool. The blue fire. And the horns. Dude, this is probably what he looked like before he got all fucked up. Because, like, I think the lore goes something like they uncovered Smelter, and Smelter brought down, like, the whole kingdom. Something like that. Oh, this is so badass. Okay, I should actually buff. Hold on. Oh, God. I thought he was powering up. Fuck. Got a whole new move set to learn. Shit, that's bad. Oh my god. Oh, it's like so bright, it's hurting my eyes. Oh, fucking delays attack now. That's not good. Dude, he's got a whole new move set. Do you know how long it took me to learn Smelter's move set? I must have fought him like 15 times. And finally I beat him. I felt so good. Like. Oh my god, he looks so cool. Uh, I don't love the rolling attack on the Murakumo, though. It's uh, not a great rolling attack. Oh shit. Okay. Yeah, bring it on, motherfucker. Oh god, dude, his sword got twice as big. What the fuck? No stamina!
Uh oh. Not that. No, no, no! No! Oh, shit. First fucking boss, and it's fucking super powered smelter. Jesus Christ. That's sick. Okay, so smelter was badass, but I decided I'd probably backtrack and go this way. I'm not sure if this DLC is probably actually not set up anything like the previous one at all. I mean, just by the standards, the way the level's been designed so far. Um, I like the way the other one was set up, but it always end uh, like after you killed a boss, it actually every time led to a dead end. That's just because two of the three bosses like led to each other, so which I like. It's very different. They've never done something like that before. Oh God! Okay, now this guy was a dick. <laughs> He's totally taunted me. Yeah, what's up, dude? You want to taunt me again? Ah. Uh. Okay, the repost did about as much as the backstab did last time. Now he might run again. What a dude? Are you? Ki oh my God! I probably should have buffed. Oh, good, nice. Oh, oh. Oh man, don't you run. Don't you fucking run. Dude, I love it when you go to guard break a, a red invader, like an NPC invader. Don't you do it, you fucking dick. Okay. Okay. I, I actually, I kind of like this, like the way they're having, I really actually really like what they're doing with the NPCs. Like, they've become so human-like. I mean, they're pretty predictable and they're kind of bullshit the way they can like, uh, very predict dodge you. But I love how they're, like, taunting you, and then, like, this guy runs away when he gets, like, quarter of a health. Like, no, I'm gonna go run for the enemies. Like, your usual Red Invaders wouldn't do that. They'd usually follow you away from them, you know what I mean? Uh, okay, that's not petrification down there. It's curse. So what I'm gonna do is... Uh, I, I never know whether to keep on the Clorthenji Ring or the Third Dragon Ring. I don't think I really need... Because, like, yeah, my equip load is still good, right? Like, I'm still rolling fine. Alright, I'm gonna take off the Third Dragon Ring. Um, I'm going to throw on the curse resist ring, which I, the curse bite ring, because we've gotten plus one of other rings, there must be a, uh, plus one curse ring around here somewhere. Uh, I really should keep on the ring of blades, but I kind of want to put on, like, I know I'm going to get cursed down here, so I kind of want to put on the ring of binding, which is actually a really good ring if you're getting cursed a lot. Um, I'll, I'll go down a little bit. If I find myself really getting screwed, I will put on the ring of binding. As opposed to the Ring of Blades. I really should go get the Ring of Blades plus two. Okay. Oh. What? Dude, how did that miss? Someone explain to me how that missed. I was actually dicks. Then they can hit me through the... Bitch. That's... I fucking hate that. I can't swing through that, but en uh, enemies can. Oh my god. It's the plunging attack, man. I'll tell you, I was playing Dark Souls 1 not that long ago, and the plunging attack, no problems. Like, the first time I did it on an enemy, did not miss. Killed him, you know what I mean? I do it here, I'm like right in front of him, I miss. It's I don't know what they did to it, but I just, I don't know. It's like the one thing they I feel like they really messed up on when reprogramming for 2. Or even if they just ported the code, I have no idea.